What is going on? I am King Sean back at it again with another NBA Live 15 Rising Star video. Now, I know it's been like two and a half to three weeks since I uploaded my last Live 15 video. And my bad. Let me go ahead and apologize. It's my fault. But there's a reason behind that. And that reason is I got hit with some cheese. I got hit with some BS. It's not EA fault. It's not NBA Live fault. It's mainly my fault, but it was more of an accident than me doing something on purpose. But before we get into that, the MVP goes to Carmelo Anthony, and he was the league leader in points. So he was doing his damn thing this season. But here goes the BS. As you see, everything, every series is a one game series. So that messed up my entire game that messed up my entire Adrian Hall season and him the rising star foul period so oh man pretty much what happened was I was creating Adrian Hall and I guess I hit left on the playoff series tab by accident and it switched it to a seven game series to a one game playoff series so that messed up everything I wound up having to restart Adrian Hall I got drafted to the 76ers and as you see the Knicks is going to give up J.R. Swish aka J.R. Smith so that means I got my flat top brother on the squad Iman Shumpert aka Stax Montana they look like twins I'm just saying but as you see I'm simulating the entire uh, first season and we finished with like a 26 and 52 record or something like that it was just terrible we wind up missing the playoffs the Chicago Bulls wind up winning the championship so they are the 2014 2015 NBA champions and I thought about leaving man I really thought about leaving it just depended on what team wanted me or what team was gonna offer somebody for me now the only reason I was thinking about leaving is because I want to wear some dope shoes and the colorway on the New York Knicks, I've been saying this forever, I don't like the orange and blue when it comes to shoes. I wind up staying on the team though because I got to stay loyal to my hometown team and it worked out to be the best option because our GM got Amari Stoudemire off the team and LaMarcus Aldridge wanted to play for us. In his words, New York is where I want to be. I checked the roster and he is on the team. L.A. Mello, Shumpert, Adrian Hall, Jose Calderon, and Timmy Jr. We also got rid of our two most biggest disappointing contracts. That is Amari Stoudemire and Andrea Bargnani. So no Amari, no Bargnani, and L.A. to the squad. I'm, I'm loving this team already, man. We needed a big man that can play defense and grab boards and drop buckets. And we got that in LaMarcus Aldridge. Now, I'm not saying now that we got him, we're going to make it to the finals. But damn it, we should make it to the playoffs this time. We missed the playoffs when I started simulating. But we're going to make the playoffs this time for a fact. When I seen that I had 22,000 skill points, I went ham. I started upgrading everything that I needed. Dunking, vertical, three-point shooting, mid-range shooting, free throws, stamina, everything. I started upgrading everything as you see right here. But in my next Rising Star video, we're going to be playing our first game of the season against the Detroit Pistons. And by the way, I also changed up Adrian Hall just a little bit. I made him six foot two this time instead of six foot four or six foot five like I had him last time. I also changed him from a shooter to a slashing point guard. So hopefully this means I'm gonna be getting more posterizing dunks in the paint. That's what I hope for. I wish I can get more posterizing dunks because as a shooter, I wasn't getting no dunks at all on anybody, but Let's get into the changes around the NBA. Victor Oladipo and Ray Allen is the new additions to OKC. Ah, that just made them even more tougher to beat. But Rondo took his talents to Orlando. And they also got Reggie Jackson. And they also drafted Joel Embiid. Now on the 76ers, you all know I got traded for J.R. Smith. They got MCW. They got Nerlens Noel. They also got Clee Anthony Early. And they got Doug McBuckets. Now, taking a look at San Antonio, they lost Timmy D and Manu Ginobili. They also added Martel Webster and Paul Pierce, which means somebody got traded to the Wizards, and that is Timmy 
D. Tim Duncan, Mr. Fundamentals. I kind of don't like this trade because it goes down to the simple fact that Tim Duncan would never leave San Antonio and neither will Manu Ginobili. Speaking of Manu Ginobili, he took his talent to Milwaukee to join up with Jabari Parker and Brandon Knight and the rest of the Milwaukee Bucks. Now, out of all the teams I just showed you that added people to their team, got new additions to their squad, which one was the best to you? Rondo joining Joel Embiid and Reggie Jackson in Orlando, LA coming to the Knicks, making another big three with Carmelo, me in LA, or OKC grabbing Ray Allen and Victor Oladipo. So that's Victor Oladipo, Ray Allen, KD, and Westbrook. That's mean. But anyway, my next Rising Stars video will be my first game of the second season with the big three. I cannot wait. Stop on that like button for my next Rising Star video. Coming soon. Showing off the safes. LA getting back to back buckets under the basket as I'm calling for the screen, making my way to the paint, drawing a foul, could not get the and one. So y'all know I'm going to that stripe to try to give out that sense from the free throw line. Y'all know what I 